everybody, it's Rena, and I'm coming to you today. Yes, you have seen this bubble gum machine before, or gumball, you guys call it a gumball machine, I call it a bubble gum machine. Anyway, I know you've seen it before, but um, I just couldn't stand it and I had to show it to you guys, but I knew that my plan all along was to put it on this altered dresser. So I want to show the whole thing and um, tell you that this is another creation for my swap with Matea. And Matea, um, I know you already loved the bubblegum machine, so I'm delighted that you did because the plan, like I said all along, was to add it to this, um, this dresser. And I am so off the charts tempted to keep this, but I hope you love it. That's all I can say. So I've already done uh, my video on the gum bubblegum machine so do check that out as a separate video um, the dresser is pretty simple it's one of the ones from Joann's and um, I don't know it's probably like 10 inches tall or something like that um, I added this these beautiful um, pieces that I believe I got from saw crafters um, on the front and then what I did was I just popped off the the knobs and I I glued hot glued the the ornate metal pieces and then I just glued the the knob back on so I um, cut out all the paper from the collection every drawer is lined and I did learn something uh, because I I it was so cold here it was like negative 10 I could not go outside and spray paint so I decided to gesso the entire um, inside of the box and it turned out that the gesso is very thick and it created problems with the drawers sliding in. So I had to, after I gessoed, I had to go and sand everything. Um, when I've spray painted, I have not had an issue, um, but I did have an issue this time. And these do pull out, but they're still a little bit stiff um, and hard to pull out with just one hand. So um, I used the paper collection on this. Um, let me show you. I picked this up on Black Friday, and it's the Pretty Princess stack from DCWV, and that is it. So, um, I know that Matea likes Shabby Chic, so, um, yeah, let me show you the side. I used this beautiful, beautiful um, lace, and I actually have to really apologize because I have no idea where it came from. Um, I made a purchase and I got a package and it said it was from Malaysia. I didn't even realize I had ordered from Malaysia. Um, but it came with a whole bunch of stuff I had ordered and it didn't say where it was from. And usually it has some kind of invoice or something and then I can make track of, keep track of where it's from. This didn't. So I have no idea. Um, cause I order so much that I can't even remember. Um, I have this beautiful bling piece from the DIY Boutique Supply, and I wanted to stay with that shabby glam feel on the dresser, and that's why I did these pieces, and I added the bling piece, um, the exact same on, on this side as on the other side. And then down here, this is a trim that I got at Joann's, um, also on Black Friday, and I made that go all, all the way around. Um, the back so there it is my altered dresser for Matea with the um, altered gumball machine and I hope she likes it I absolutely love 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 it and um, there you go okay have a happy scrappy day bye bye guys see you soon